see, Jairus, I don't see why you've been making me do all of these weird endurance exercises. I've been doing them all week, and you haven't even told me what they're for. Can I get down now, please? Ah, good. Oh, there we go. Finally. Ah, oh, that hook. You've been the bane of my life, little hook. <laughs> but why have you been making me do all these weird exercises? Please talk to me. Why have you been doing all these weird exercises for me? Ah. I'm ready. I'm ready for what? Huh. Oh, a surprise. Oh, let's have a look in here. Testing chamber. Oh my goodness. Are you joking right now? This is a rocket. <laughs> a, ro a rocket. You've been training me for a space program? Juris, where are you? Why didn't you follow me in? I haven't been in the testing chamber for ages. You've been telling me to stay out of there. <laughs> you are so sneaky. You know that this is one of the things that I have really, really wanted to do recently, especially since we've been doing these crazy adventures. And I actually cannot believe this. Right then, Charles, let's go into the testing chamber and you're going to have to tell me what I need to do because this is one crazy, crazy rocket. I mean, we've been to space before. We've been to the moon and we did not use a rocket this big. So what's the plan? <sighs> Whoa. That's a step further than where we've been before. Mars is a little bit further than the moon. I'm guessing that's why we've got this crazy, crazy rocket. Right then, what do we got to do next? Uh. Okay, fuel the rocket. Uh. Yep. Uh. Okay, let, let's do these things. Let's have a look in this chest here. Okay, what have we got? We've got um, lots of fuel. That's good because we're going to need to get to Mars. We've also got um, oxygen mask, oxygen gear, heavy oxygen tanks, a light blue parachute, and a lead. A lead's a little bit random. Why have we got the lead? Okay, and oh my goodness. Is this, is this mine? Look at this. <laughs> It's like a, a space astronaut outfit. Charles, is this mine? Uh -huh. Oh, yeah, I'm going to put it on straight away. Here we go. Ah, there we go. Yes, I can't wait. What do I look like? Ah, oh, yes. <laughs> My goggles are gone, but I'm looking awesome. Look at me. Yeah, I'm an astronaut. Oh my goodness, I've had all the training, thanks to Traoris, and now, thanks to Traoris also, we have this crazy, crazy rocket. So, we need to um, fuel this rocket, and I remember from doing our little space programs before, we need to use this machine right here, which is the fuel loader, to be able to load the fuel into this rocket. Now, this rocket is like five times the size of the rocket we've used before, so I'm guessing we're going to need a lot of fuel, so if we just, uh, can I sit in it? quickly i want to sit in it quickly ah. yeah okay let's go in here here we go nice there we go where's my face where's my beautiful face there it is <laughs> this rocket is huge but we need to check how much fuel it's got no fuel whatsoever wow so we need to start getting this completely fueled up so let's do that right now let's grab as many of these fuels as possible i'm not sure we're going to need all of them but let's plop this fuel in here grab the empty canister put this in here as well grab all the canisters out and we should be good to go. And we're going to need these empty canisters as well for when we go uh, to Mars. Because otherwise, we're not going to be able to get back, are we? Because we need to refuel the fuel that is left over from when we take off. Which hopefully is enough to get us back. Otherwise, we're going to be in major trouble. But let's quickly check how much we've got now. Oh, we're almost on 100%. Let's watch it go to 100. Here we go. Yes! <laughs> I think we're ready to go. This is a little bit weird. I can't believe... We're going to go to Mars. I mean, I don't even know what we're going to find there. Do you have any idea, Traoris? Uh. No, I don't either. This is going to be the best. Are you coming as well? Uh. Okay, well, well, you've got to be a little bit careful because last time we went to space, you changed. You changed a little bit and um, I'm not going to explain what happens. We'll find out if it happens on Mars because we've only been to the moon and it happened there. So let's see if it happens on Mars. But anyway, guys. I think we're ready to go to Mars. What we need first, though, is an oxygen supply. So let's grab some of this and the tank. We also need our parachute so that when we come back to the lab and land in the lab, we have some way to land. And this random lead that Treyos was talking about. So let's plop on our gear. So we need to put the oxygen mask here, our gear here, and then our two oxygen tanks as well. And our parachute too. And we should... Be good to go. Because if we can't breathe on Mars, we're going to be in major, major trouble. So, Jairus, are we ready for liftoff? Uh. Awesome. Let's do this. Okay, there, Jairus. Here we go. Oh, my goodness. I'm super nervous. I think the countdown's about 20 seconds. So, we've got a little bit of time to prepare. But this rocket is so huge. And you can hear how powerful it is. Here we go. Oh, my goodness. 
<laughs> I'm actually flying a rocket. Look at the stars. And we just passed the clouds as well. Oh, man. Goodbye, lab. See you later. Look at the flames and look. That's the rest of the desert that the lab is in and the rest of the world. It's just a tiny little square from up here. Oh, Charles, I'm scared. Charles, I'm scared. What am I doing? What's happening right now? Oh! It's so weird. It's really, really weird. Why am I inside some kind of casing? Oh, jeez. Charles, are you here? Have we, have, we, have we landed? This is super weird. Let me try and bust out. Okay. Here we are. Look. It looks so amazing. This is Mars. And this is the weird bubble thing that we um, we arrived in. So let me just punch this open. Can I punch it? There we go. Oh! <laughs> Dreyarus, it even happens on Mars as well. Oh, dear buddy. You don't do too well at all now. Oh, wait a second. Is this why you brought the lead with you? Oh. All right. Okay. So, guys, we're going to need to use the lead to, uh, we're gonna need to use it to drag Churros around. Let me just grab, um, the rocket and stuff, because we're gonna need that. But, um, yeah, we need to drag Churros around because his legs are so swollen that he can't even move. So, I guess we should go and explore. Let, let's go and check this out. Look at this. Oh, we've got, like, anti-gravity as well. Look at this, Churros. Boing. <laughs> this looks incredible. Oh, man, is there anything even around here? The oxygen tanks are working perfectly as well. Come on, Dreyarus. Let's go for a little walk, shall we? Ugh. No, I'm stuck in this crater now. <laughs> Why are you tell us to come this way? Actually, it's not too bad. If you just bounce up as well. Look at that. <laughs> Dreyarus is having a whale of a time. Look at him. Absolutely loving it. Come on then, buddy. Let's go up here and see if there's anything. We haven't found anything yet, which is a little bit disappointing. But the best thing is that we can actually lift off wherever we kind of um, want to because we've got these launch pads. So cool. <laughs> your head is huge. Oh, my goodness. Maybe that's the size of your brain in real life. But anyway, let's bounce up here and... Oh! No way. Oh, look at this as well. Look, there's the earth. <laughs> Could you see the lab from here? Oh, I, I, I don't think you can. But anyway, Charles, look what I found. What is this? They look like you. Or you you look like them. <laughs> oh, my God. Calm down, buddy. No, chill out. Chill out. It's okay. It's okay. Just chill out a little bit. Right then, look at these guys. They look exactly like you. Oh, what's that? There's something in the distance as well. Maybe these guys know what it is. Look at this. They're looking at us. Charles, they're looking at us. Just, just be chill. Just be chill, okay? We, we come in peace, um, strange villager people. Are you okay? Charles, let's, let's get through this gate here, and um, then we can introduce ourselves. Um, this is extremely odd. <laughs> oh, man. Charles, come through here. What are you doing? You need to come through. You know what? I'm going to help you out here. Let me just grab... Um, nope, careful. You lost your lead. There we go. Got it back. Uh, I'm just going to quickly grab some of this so that I can uh, try and hop you over this fence. Actually, should we just break this gate? They're not going to be too happy with us if we do this, but I will replace it. It's okay. I'm sorry. <laughs> All right, come on, Charles. Come through the gap. Come through the gap so we can introduce ourselves. Are you being Are you being like this on purpose? Why are you doing this to us? We, we can't just be like this when we've only just found these moon villagers. How are you? Lord Blue. What are you? Hello? Um, Charles, these guys speak a very, very odd language. You know what? Oh, no. <laughs> this is not going very well, is it, buddy? You're being like a pain in the butt because you can't even, you can't even walk properly. But anyway, just let's put this here. And I'm going to try and communicate with this guy. Um, he's speaking in a strange language. This isn't normal villager language. <sighs> No, I don't know what he's saying. Churros, uh, do you know what he's saying? Uh. Yeah, give it a go. Try it out. Oh, I'm looking forward to hearing this. Go on, Andreas. Try and speak alien villager. Can you do it? Uh. Wait, he's responding. Uh. He's actually responding. Churros, it's working. Carry on. Uh. What's he saying? Uh. The mysterious egg has been stolen. What does, that, what does that even mean? We need to explore this place a little bit more. Right, Churros, if you feel like coming in here, then feel free. But if you don't, then... Just stay there and don't go anywhere, please. Jeez, right then. Um, oh, this place is looking magical. Really magical. And what's that in the distance as well? This is insane. Look, they've got all these really weird chests. And was that something supposed to be here? Mysterious egg. Maybe, maybe the mysterious egg is supposed to be here. Oh, man. They've got one of these as well. Look at this. A moon buggy. <laughs> 
That's incredible. All right, Traoris, you need to ask if this is where the mysterious egg was supposed to be. Traoris, I can't speak alien yet. Where are you? Right, you need to you need to communicate to um, Lord Blue here um, what, what I'm trying to say. Try it. There we go. That sounds good. Okay. What's he saying? Wow, the evolved mobs stole the mysterious egg. Do, do they want us to help him out? Maybe we could do it, Traoris. We could do that. What did he say? <laughs> yeah, he could do it. Yeah, we could do that. Lord Blue, don't you worry. We will get your mysterious egg back. But, um... Oh, wait a second. Are the evolved mobs over there? Is it in that castle? Okay, I understand that. That's got to be a yes, right? Good. <laughs> right, can we use your moon buggy? Ask if we can use the moon buggy to get over there. It looks like it might be quite easy um, to get over there rather than just jumping. <laughs> Yep, I saw that. A little nod of the head and... Oh, wait a second. Trust, what did he say? Oh, really? Oh, wow, that's amazing. Thank you so much. Don't worry. We'll get your mysterious egg back. Right then, let's go through here. Sorry, guys. Sorry, I don't mean to be barging in like this, but um, I'm a human. It's okay. And the oxygen level is doing pretty well as well in the top right-hand corner. Right then, the double chest... What have we got in here? We have got... Oh, wow. Look at this. We've got um three blocks of cheese. We've got some throwable meteor chunks. These ones are hot ones. Look. <laughs> look at that. We've got a grappling hook, some armor, some heavy duty armor, and a desh sword. Can't say I've ever seen a desh sword before, but let's put all of this stuff away just in case um, it gets in the way. Because we're going to need that to get home anyway. We've got the lead. Um, let's just grab all this stuff. My goodness, look how generous he's being. This is insane. And some food as well, because I am going to get a little bit hungry up here. Right then. Oh, look at that. It goes on the outside of my astronaut suit. <laughs> I'm looking good. And this dash sword is amazing as well. We've also got some throwable meteor chunks, which look really, really nice. And a grappling hook. Cool. Right then, Lord Blue, we will save you. Do not worry. Is this you? Yes, it is. <laughs> Do not worry, buddy. Right then, let's um, close this off so no one can get in and trust. You ready? Good. Let's drag you over. So we're going to use the moon buggy. This is going to be super, super awesome. Hopefully, it's all fueled up because this right here looks like a normal um, fuel canister, actually. <laughs> it's so funny that you do that. Um, let me try it and see if it's got any fuel. It has. It's got 100%. Um, Charles, you okay? Are you still attached? Um, I hope so. Oh, yeah, he is. Look. Oh, what are you doing? I'm not, I don't want to run you over. Look, come on. Let's go. Oh, this is cool. This is really cool. Yes. <laughs> over to this crazy alien castle. It looks like it's held up by laser beams. This is insane. <laughs> not as insane as this buggy, though. And it looks like that grappling hook is going to come in handy because... We're not going to be able to get up to that castle without it. It looks like there's a platform just there we could use. But, um, Traoris, I think I'm going to have to leave you here because you can't use the grappling hook and you're going absolutely crazy. So let me just park up the buggy here. Like, uh, this. There we go. And I'm going to have to leave you here, buddy. So don't run off. Oh, no, the lead. I keep forgetting that the gravity affects all this as well. <laughs> this is not good. Right then, buddy. Stay here. Do not do anything weird or anything like that. And here we go. Let's use the grappling hook. And I'm, I really don't know how to use this. So I'm a little bit worried. Let's try it out, shall we? Oh, dear. Let's try this. Let's try it. Here we go. Um, if I can grapple up there, we should be good. Let me see if I can grab the edge of this. I do not know what to expect, though. But a mob army on Mars... It doesn't really sound good. Trust, please don't move too far. <laughs> I need to go and grab you on the way back. Here we go. Huh? Grappling hook. Here we go. Let's try and charge it up and boom. Is it not working? Gra grappling hook. I need you to... Let's try it. Here we go. Uh... Ah. There we go. It worked. It worked. Oh my goodness. <laughs> no. Oh jeez, I fell. I absolutely fell. That's not good. Let's try this one more time. I think I can get it this time. If I do a quick jump and then fire it, we should be good. Yes, go on. Oh, no, there's creepers and stuff up here. Here they go. Here we go. Ah, ah, don't blow up. Don't blow up. Oh, no, he knocked me off. Why would you do such a thing? Oh, jeez, this is scary. This is really, really scary. I don't like this at all. And look at this guy. He's got two bows. These guys have, like, all kinds of oxygen and stuff as well. 
This is madness. This is a lot more difficult than I thought it was going to be. You know what? I'm going to eat some cheese. <laughs> if in doubt, eat some cheese. There we go. Look at that. It looks so nice. Oh, it's fresh from the moon. Oh, there's, there's zombies as well. Let's see if we can get back up here. Uh, oh, no. I'm going to I'm gonna have to charge it up first. And then launch it. There we go. Grappling hook master. Yes, I made it. Okay, I think I'm ready. I think I'm ready. Let's go. Let's jump up in. Oh, there's so many. Oh, geez. Look at these guys. Oh, they're hitting me. They dropped space money. <laughs> this is cool. Right, I think if I stay up here, I should be okay. Look at these guys. Oh, my goodness. This is insane. Right, let me grab this block of cheese. Eat it a little bit. And here we go. Oh, man. These guys are crazy. Good job I've got this crazy armor on. Let's just keep on hitting. Keep on hitting and try and get out of it. Oh, I'm stuck. I'm so stuck. I need to find this egg that he was talking about. Oh, jeez. This is madness. Oh, oh, jeez. Right, then let's try and get this guy as well. Look how big these mobs are as well. They're massive. Right, where did I put my cheese? Where's my cheese? I need my cheese. Guys, I need my cheese. No, don't knock me off. Don't knock me off. I need my... Oh, no, I can't even reach the cheese. Guys, this is bad. I need to I need to reach the cheese. Go away, zombies. Right then. Oh, it looks like... Is that a shrine in the middle? Yeah, let me see if I can grab the shrine in the middle. Oh, I need to use my rocks as well. Throw these rocks. Get out of here. <laughs> oh, these rocks are working perfectly. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> this is awesome. Let me get these guys out of here. Oh, geez. These have, like, oxygen tanks and everything. This is madness. Right, got him. Got him. Let's just get through here. Let's see if we can grab what's on this bit here. Oh, man, there's so much. There's so much. Let me see if I can grab my cheese. This is perfect. Grab my cheese. Eat it. Regen a little bit and see if they can... Oh, no, there's spiders as well. They're actually going to be able to climb up and get me. I just need to regen a little bit. Let's do a plan of action. There's a, there's a skeleton there. Oh, wait. It's popped off. Let's see if we can grab it. Here we go. Let's see if we can grab what we need. Oh, geez. Where is it? Where is it? Is it around here? Have I grabbed it already? I have got it. Look. Mysterious egg. Yes. Let's get out of here. Oh, my goodness. Get out of here, zombie. <laughs> get out of here. Here we go. Traeris, I'm coming home. And let me just eat this. There we go. Lovely, lovely cheese. Nice. You know what? You can keep your space money. You can keep it. Come over here. Get out of here. I don't need all your money. Go away. Go away. We need to take this mysterious egg back to the alien villagers. Come on, Traeris. Oh, jeez. Right then, let's see if I can grab... Um, yeah, I've got my lead. Awesome. Right, I need the lead. Here we go. Grab. There we go. Nice. And we're also going to get this moon buggy. And look at them. <laughs> They're picking on each other. Let's get out of here, buddy. Let's go back to the alien village. Oh, jeez. That was intense. Look at all the arrows in me. That was so bad. <laughs> but good at the same time, of course, because we actually completed the mission. All right, let's go and take this back and take the mysterious egg... Back to its rightful owners. Hopefully, we've got enough fuel in this thing. Yeah, we've got tons. Right, then let me try and park this. Can we park it? Here we go. Careful, Charles. I need to park this. There we go. Nice. Woo! That was intense. Right, then let's go through. Let's go to the other side. Actually, I should be able to push you through here, shouldn't I? Let me just get this gate out of the way. Because you can't get through the gate. And I should be able to just push you through here. Come on, Charles. At least come and say hi. Let's not be rude, shall we? Here we go. Right, then. Where is Lord Blue? I don't really know the difference between everyone. That's not you. That's not you. There you are. Charles, you need to tell him that we've got it. Tell him that we've got the egg. <laughs> What did he say? Nice one. So should we place it on the podium? See, I'm starting to learn a little bit of Alien. At least I know that means yes. Right, and let's grab this. And here we go. Let's plop this guy on here. And there we are. That looks fantastic. I can see why it's such an important part of your community. Oh, my goodness, Travis. I think I've had enough of Mars for now. It, it's extremely hot here. And our oxygen's almost at halfway. So I think, I think it's time to say goodbye. What do you think? Come on, try and translate a goodbye to me for, um, where are you, Lord Blue? Is this you? <laughs> you and your villagers have been amazing. Thank you so much, and I'm glad that we could help you out. Can you say goodbye for us, Traoris? Go on, say goodbye. Ah. Awesome. We'll see you later, Lord Blue. Let's go out the way we came in and put this fence gate back. Here we go, out of here. There we go. Nice. Oh, my goodness, Charles. This has been incredible. Let me just grab the rocket and the launch pad. Hopefully, we've got enough fuel to get home. But um, where should we launch from? Let's launch from down here because it seems a little bit safe. And it's away from all of uh, their village and stuff. So here we go. Let's plop, plop, pop, pop, pop. Um, you're going to have to be careful there, buddy. Let me get rid of this lead. There we go. Come back. <laughs> Caught it in midair. Let me just put this back. There we go. You're in the way. I just need to pop this uh, launch pad down. And then the rockets. Are we fueled? Yes, we are. Look, 65%. Nice. You know what, Traoris? Jump in and let's get out of here. This is going to be awesome. Let's get home. Here we go. 
Almost ready for liftoff. Let's get home to the lab. See you later, Mars. <laughs> and we're out of here. Look how speedy that is. Whoa. We're here. We've made it. And I think my parachute is working. I can't see it, but it's definitely working because I'm definitely here. Look. Oh, there's a chest as well. Why is there a chest? Oh, into the water. Perfect. <laughs> here we are. We're home. Oh my goodness, this has been one crazy, crazy adventure. Um, Treoris, have, have you, did you make it back into the lab? Let's go back into the lab, guys, and see what's going on. Treoris, are you here? Are you around here anywhere, buddy? Um, oh, there you are, and you're back to normal. <laughs> Your blue self is gone, which I'm a little bit upset about. I, I was kind of looking forward to seeing you in your blueness again. But anyway, we need to get into the treasure room and put away all this stuff. I mean, we haven't got our rocket anymore because it disintegrated on the way down, but we still have this awesome space suit. Oh, we've got the armor as well. Oh, dear, I just realized I stole all their stuff. Oh, dear. But anyway, let's get to the treasure room and put all this stuff away. Woo! Okay, guys, we are done. We're putting all of the space stuff inside the uh, hidden underground treasure room. So, Charles, you ready to show them? Yeah. Awesome. Let's get going. So, we've already got the pressure plate down. So, let's just drop down. And you can see... Oh, my goodness. Charles, every time... Every time we go back upstairs, you knock this over. Can I can I knock it this way? Does that work? No. Oh, no, it's not going to work. Can I, can I knock it this way? It's so difficult to just get straight on there. Almost. Almost. That'll do. That'll do. But anyway, some of you were asking in the previous episode where the superhero stuff is. And I kept it here because it just looks so cool in here. And Jura's kind of set this up anyway. So, um, yeah, we're keeping it here for now, which I think is really cool with the doors and stuff. And Ow! It almost clamped on my face. But anyway, this is a super long room now. And oh my, Treyarch, what did I say to you while I was upstairs that you were supposed to put this stuff away? We're gonna have to. We're gonna have to do that for next time now, guys. Every time you forget to do this. But anyway, let's look at the Mars adventure, the space adventure. And here it is. So we've got Lord Blue or a statue of Lord Blue here. We've got the cheese. We've got a Mars dirt and stone on the floor, which I thought was pretty cool. We've also got a replica of the egg. We've got the armor that I was using. Um, we've got the space outfit that I was using, the astronaut outfit, and he is holding the um sword that I was using, and also the grappling hook, but it's kind of gone through his leg. Um, I don't really know what happened there, but we've also got the moon buggy replica and the rocket on the side as well Which is cool because it's kind of spinning too. So that is pretty much it. And oh, yeah We've got Charles's outfit here as well because um, well, it wasn't really an outfit It's just kind of a, a replica of what you look like when you're in space, buddy. What do you think? Yeah. yeah, it's pretty it's pretty scary So anyway, that is gonna be pretty much it for today's a custom mod adventure guys I hope that you enjoyed it and if you did please do leave a big fat thumbs up I know so many of you have been requesting a space adventures here it is is, and I hope that you enjoy it. And if you did, then please do leave a big fat thumbs up. And also, if this happens to be the first video you've seen by me, then please do subscribe and join Team TDM today for daily Minecraft videos. And also, you won't see any content like this anywhere else. It's fully custom, fully awesome, and so fun to play as well. So I'm glad you're enjoying it as much as I do. So again, thank you for watching, and I will see you all next time. Goodbye! <laughs>